Hey everybody, we are back. We just finished number one at Omine Brooks Museum. And we ended on that uh, 50, no, 60 Impala convertible and this gorgeous 57 Buick at the Omine Brooks Museum. And we've gone through most of these cars on this side, all the way down to the Viking ship at the end there. And uh, we'll just continue all, uh, our stroll. Uh, some of the cars are left already. Um, but yeah, we got a GT40 down there, an old Saab in front of us. Uh, lots of uh, mix of stuff. You got street rods, you got Mercedes convertibles, you got, you got trucks, you got cool little Ford Anglias, UK style. So cool. Anything old and they'll just keep it running over here, you know? And you got uh, the Volvo 240. I think that's an old, no, that's a Ford something over there. I don't know what it is. You got an old Cortina, the red and gold one over there. And you got a Messerschmitt with a ton of people around it. Oh, and then we got this gorgeous Sunliner. Absolutely gorgeous Sunliner. Oh, look at the matching pillows. <laughs> you got to stylize it. Yeah. Sunliner. I love this trim too. Freaking gorgeous trim. And a Continental kit. What more could you ask for, right? And then the big factory in the background. Yeah, very, very cool. We got another old English one right here. I'm gonna take uh, we'll take this uh, this segment right here for this video number two from Olminebruks Museum in Sweden right here by this gorgeous lake a little bit uh it's in the vanamo area of sweden about an hour from custom mike's uh scandinavian shenanigan hq so oh yeah got so many cool cars look at the back of these 60 cat or 60 uh, impala convertible 57 Buick, Bonneville is at 68 ish, somewhere around there. T Birds, Mustangs, Impalas, 2002 BMWs, <laughs> and a McLaren that is actually registered, got taillights and everything, and he's out driving it. <laughs> Volvo PV, oh yeah, the sports car crown, more Bonnevilles, oh yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Lots of convertibles too. People, sweets love convertibles. Anything old and odd and racy and you know, it doesn't matter if it's European, American. It's uh it's just cool. Just cool. Nice little street rod right there. So much to see. <laughs> so much to see. Yeah, you can see the Viking ship at the end there with the tall mast sticking out. You got the little Volvo, or two little Volvos right there. A little Porsche action. A lot of Mercedes too. Sometimes you just gotta let the car speak for themselves, you know. There's a lot of 58s over here. This is another old Sydney right there. What a gorgeous car. Yeah, it's like GM threw up all the chrome stuff on there, you know. Chrysler, big fin Chrysler. God, I love those things. What a setting. What a setting. You got the MG crowd going here. I gotta take a peek at those black ones. Just perfection. Yeah. 
Got an enthusiast for everything, you know? I love these Victorias too. A lot of Connie kits here too. Look at this thing. Mikey Likey. <laughs> Another one of those trims. Love that sweep up to the fender. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, look at that, the 59 Buick. <laughs> we call that a Brookspiel. You know, one that's a daily driven kind of rod, you know? But yeah, we started actually the live video over and there. Well, we'll go back and look at it just in case you haven't watched the live. So. We'll make this whole sweep. We're only six minutes in. Little Volvo P4 544. Uh, this thing is absolutely off the rocker. So fine. Oh, so fine. Car. We got a nice little vet too. Actually, got lots of vets. They like the vets here. They like the Camaros. And they like the Mercedes you see. So, but we'll walk around. So, <laughs> Grand National Rosa Show. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I love that. Uh, this is the Soto Fireflight or a Fire or Dome or whatever they call that one, yeah. Excuse me. Yeah, we, we lost a, a few cars already. You can see a couple of them are cruising away. I'm about an hour away, and there's people I've seen here that are probably two and three hours away. Um, so. You can understand that some of them are even lower than others. Uh, you got a Hummer here too. Love the back windows and uh, these old English floors. Makes for good little hot rods when you chop them. <laughs> and you got a band going too. You got some B dubs. Another one of those four. I think they call those old ones in Angley out too. They love their American cars, that's for damn sure. Oh, yeah. oh that sounds so good. Then you got food, food line going right here. We got lots and lots of bikes. This is kind of the cruise area where everybody cruise by. Got some really cool bikes and trikes, food, and there's even a moped area right here with several old mopeds, some of them I've had myself. And the whole park's full of cool motorcycles and mopeds. Enthusiasts from all over. What a show. What a show. Boy, that jack just sounds like a million bucks. Absolutely sounds like a million bucks. Pure pleasure walking in with it. <laughs> we'll walk in among the bikes, get a little bit of the, uh, the bike mix here too. You can see a little more of the factory too because it's a phenomenal place. But look at all these bikes. It's a Wednesday night. Oh, they're even parking them over there now, too. Yeah, so, but we are at... Oh, I'm in the Brooks Museum in Vanamo area. Oh, that's that little old Ford leaving again. That <laughs> Goodwood sticker in the window. How cool is that? Oh, yeah, you're going to see a lot of people cruising out. A little Continental. Got that old saw. Yep, yep, yep. So, there was a chopper in here I wanted to show you guys too. Uh, this is a crazy one, but a mix of bikes is really everywhere. Another salt chopper right there. But there's a couple of radical ones over here I want to drool at.
Nice. Tight in here with a little cruise around. Look at it. What a ride, man! Thanks for bringing her out. Wow, so cool. Anyway, so yeah, that's the motorcycle area. So we're at about 10 minutes in on this one too. And then, yeah, there's feeding areas inside. You can buy a hot dog and waffles. See here, you got hamburgers and beer, all kinds of other stuff. And I think and then you can go in and see all the old equipment and stuff. But I think I'm gonna go and uh, enjoy myself a little bit. And you got these two videos to drool at. You get an idea of the old stuff that's actually here. There's just some really cool old bikes right here. And a cool old trike right there. So, yeah. What a fun place. What a fun place. And, yeah, you got a band going too. So, which is really cool. What a set. Yeah, Ferrari. <laughs> oh yeah. I think we came at the right time. You know, we got a chance to take. Well, I took about 55 pictures. You can find those on our uh, Facebook page. And uh, then we got. We're gonna have, end up with two videos uh, here on uh, Custom Mike's YouTube. And they'll be both about 12, 15 minutes each. Um, so, what a show, what a night, what a place. Thank you guys for hanging with me here at Custom Ikes in Omine, uh, Sweden, right by a lake. We'll end on this uh, GT40 for you if you have something to drool at at the last minute. Love you all, you know what to do. Like, share, comment, subscribe. It makes a difference for me. It doesn't cost you anything and I appreciate it. Thanks a lot. See you at the next one. See ya.